hello everyone welcome back to my channel so today guys I got something exciting I want to share with you I don't think I've done one on my channel but I have featured these uh, eyeshadows so what I want to share with you are my top five eyeshadows which I think in my personal opinion are my eyeshadow palettes that I want to share with you so guys, if you want to see what my top five uh, eyeshadow palettes are, then you just stay tuned. So, I want to start with the number five on my list, and then I'll work my way up to number one. So my number five eyeshadow palette is a oldie but a goodie, is my Morphe 35B palette. And the reason it's number five is because it's a good size. It's not the greatest to travel with, but it also does not have a mirror. But the pros and the reason why I love this uh, palette so much are uh, the reason it's num my number five is because look at the colors in this palette beautiful for summer and spring it has the blues the purples the greens the pinks the red and pink some neutrals yellow oh my god anything that you would want to wear in the summer or the spring or anytime you feel like it this is the palette and of course you know it's 35 so uh, the B is for the bright colors and uh, they're very, very pigmented and very, very vibrant. Um, it is also reasonably priced on Morphe's website. This palette is just $23 and I think that's a bargain. And um, that means uh, roughly, it's $23 for this palette. So that's roughly about 65, 66 cents per pan and I think if you got single pans now like from maybe um, Makeup Geek even Mac it's like five or six dollars so 65 66 cents per pan can't beat that my second favorite palette is the Huda Beauty now number one it is a 60 $5. This palette retails for $65, but it has a huge mirror. It comes with um, 18 shades. Um, let's see, one's a glitter. This shade here is called Cosmo. It is the glitter shade. It comes with eight mattes six shimmers and it comes with three dual crumbs. So number three on my list is the Tartlet in Bloom palette and this isn't this such cute packaging. It's always been a really really nice palette and I chose this because it's number one you use even travel easy to travel with. You can throw it in your purse or wherever you want to throw it. The full lid is a mirror which is nice. The colors in here are fantastic. Oh they're so beautiful. It's 12 colors in here. There's mattes and luster finishes. This palette retails for $46 and um, they're real blendable, really, really pigmented. And it's a nice neutral palette too, guys. If you can see, it's really a lot of nice neutral colors and these shimmers are really, really, really pigmented. They're really fantastic. My number two palette of all time is the Magic Palette by Juvia. And I chose this as big. It's one of the bigger palettes, but I chose this because mainly, mainly of these colors. As you can see guys, these colors are very, very, very beautiful. 
highly pigmented and they are double, almost double the size of the other shadows in the palette. It's 16 shades in here and it's a fusion of cool and warm shades. You can see there's a lot of shimmers and there's one, two, three, four, five, six is six mattes in and oh it retails on the website only you can get it on the website for $32 for the size of the pans and the color payoff guys this is worth it all and my number one is the modern renaissance palette from Anastasia Beverly Hills number one reason I can take it it is very small and easy on the go and of course you guys know that it comes with a mirror but this is the brush that it comes with and it is a double ended brush okay it comes with 14 shades it's highly pigmented and it is seriously the best and it is amazing I actually used the colors today to create this look and I, I only used two colors in, in this um, palette but it is wonderful wonderful it is very 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 vibrant colors very pigmented and you have to have a light handed because yes these are really really nice so guys that is all for my top five eyeshadows there are many more that I like or love but those are my top five that I really really I had to go through all these palettes and I was like back and forth back and forth which ones are my favorite I have to only choose five so guys those are my top five and I thank you guys for watching and so guys until my next video I will see you on the next one and oh yeah don't forget to subscribe bye guys